Welcome to CRM Crew, my name is Nick and in today's quick tutorial I'm going to be explaining what are and how to use scoring rules in Zoho CRM. So once you log into your Zoho CRM system of course you'll come to the home screen. Now I'll briefly explain what scoring rules is. Essentially it's a means of scoring records for certain modules inside of your Zoho CRM system to determine the value of the records depending on the data inside of those records. So let's say you've got data that is not good or the information that's been provided usually means that the record doesn't perform as well from a sales perspective for example you can score those records lower or if it's good information and you're certain that the information that's been provided usually adds value to your business you can um you can add or add points to a score and that the that, term that, that demonstrates that, that that particular record is going to be useful. So in order to add scoring rules, you need to go to the cog in the top right hand corner, but do ensure you have administrative permissions. So we'll press the cog and then from here we want to go to automation and then to scoring rules. And then as you can see here, we have our scoring rules options. Now we have four modules that we can choose from leads, contacts, accounts and deals. And we can score those records inside of those modules depending on the data. Uh, for these four. So I'm going to choose contacts as our example today. So I'm going to select contacts and then obviously we have our email insights and we can score based on email insights. So that's like bounce back rates for example or the actual contacts module itself. So I'm going to select the contacts module itself and then press add and then as you can see here we have or add or subtract points and we can change the number of points dependent on the field data that we are going to set. So the criteria are set we can either add or subtract depending on what we want to do. So if I say account name is equal to CRM crew, I want to add 10 points because that means I know, so we could say that potentially I know CRM crew, they spend a lot of money with us. So I'm going to add 10 points if their account name is equal to CRM crew. We can also add additional data and we can do it and on an and or basis so we can say the and or basis and then we can say account name is equal to and another thing for example i don't know lead source is equal to and then we can select the lead source is an advertisement so we set and or so let's say the account name is CRM crew and the lead source is advertisement. We know this is going to be good business. So we're going to add 10 points. We know this is a good record. So let's press save there. So we've added that lead source. Uh, sorry, we've, we've added that. We've added that um, scoring rule. And then we can add an additional scoring rule. And let's say we subtract and then account. Uh, we could go lead source again is always a good one is Oh, sorry, is equal to cold call. Let's say we know that cold calls are notoriously bad for contacts. So we could subtract 10 points as a result. So press the subtract button and then the number of points. Of course, you can change the points. So let's say you want to change it to five points, for example. And then we just press the save button. We are then creating these different scoring rules for the records for the contacts module. Now, once you've done that and you've set them all, you can then run scoring rules for all records. And this will then create all this, this will work out the scores based on the records that are existing inside of the Zoho CRM system. And it will give you some results. It does take a minute, so I've, I've already done it on our deals module. So I'll head over to the deals module and I say, oh, what I've said is lead source is a cold call, subtract 10 points, and amount is equal to or over 10,000 pounds, then add 10 points. So I've run the scoring rules and now I'm going to head over to our deals module. But do bear in mind it's exactly the same for all the modules. And then I'm going to go on any particular record. So I use King as an example here. And then just scroll down and we can see our score summary. So we've got a positive score of 10. Um, it also says it up the top left hand corner here. We've got a positive score of 10 and it gives us our information. It will also tell us our negative point score if it was any. So let's say we change the lead source to cold call, which is what I set for deals as well. It would then update accordingly. And that is how to use scoring rules in your Zoho CRM system. I hope this video has clearly explained what are and how to use scoring rules in Zoho CRM. If you do have any further questions, please drop me an email. My details are in the description below. Otherwise, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you shortly in the next video. Thank you and goodbye.